Hey everybody, welcome to the VHF UHF channel. And you might be thinking, yeah, but you've got a shortwave radio in your hand. What does it do in the VHF UHF channel? Well, I wanted to talk about the RadioWow R108 receiver's capability of actually getting the airband. So this receiver is one of the shortwave receivers, and you see here it's tuned to 134, 150 right now. One of the receivers that actually can receive the airband. And I wanted to talk a little bit about how it performs on the airband on this channel. So the RadioWow R108, I've, I've tuned and, and scanned the airband with it um, quite a few times and enjoyed listening to airplanes and aircrafts. I got in, you know, got airports here and there's a lot of planes passing overhead. So of course it adds to the enjoyment of getting the airband on a radio that is also a shortwave radio. There's nothing on shortwave, but there's really nothing interesting at the moment. You can go back on the airband and listen to some airplanes passing by into the airport. But is it comparable to a scanner radio? Here's the thing. This is nice. It's nice add-on, and um, I'm, I, I'm totally okay with the fact that they added the airman capability on it. Where it falls short is on sensitivity, first of all. This airband receiver is not as sensitive on the airband as a dedicated scanner is. You got to say also the dedicated scanner will have a dedicated antenna that's maybe more um, you know, tuned to the airband frequencies. That also is something that maybe is helping out. It does a basic job at getting the good signals, or strong signals. But if I compare this, and we'll try to do a few uh, tests with my ICOM R20, or even, you know, not going very expensive because this thing is, of course, barely, you know, 40, 50 bucks. Um, if I take my Uniden scanner that's a basically a $100 scanner, um, it still performs better than this. The other thing is, one of the things we like in the airband is sometimes we park on the frequency. For that, it's cool. But sometimes we want to scan, like we do right now. Scan speed is very slow on this radio for the airband. So it's not like a scanner. You know, if you use a dedicated, dedicated scanner, you'll see that the scanning speed is really fast today. And that actually does help in, in not missing out on signals that might be, you know, especially in the airband, signals tend to be very temporary. So uh, that also is a drawback. But overall, if I have to say um, something about it, good or bad, you do have the airband. It's kind of cool. And it does a basic job at listening to the airband. Yes, absolutely. So... Um, that's pretty much what I wanted to say about the Radio Owl R108 in the airband capability. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.